want to start off with some breaking news this morning. There's been an officer involved shooting on Las Vegas Boulevard near 4th Street. Also a second shooting in the parking lot of an east side hotel. This one happened around 7 o'clock Saturday night at the town and country manor near Boulder Highway in Tropicana. Meanwhile, a police chase on foot ends with one suspect behind bars, another dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Frightening moments for a truck driver in New York, and it's all caught on camera. Take a look. This is video. Another driver recorded on his dash camera. You can see an oncoming semi truck trying to make it over the tracks when a freight train hits him, sending him down the track about 200 feet. The man who shot two Maryland firefighters killing one has been released from custody without any charges. We've been following the story all morning long. A crash that killed one person and sent more than 30 others to the hospital last night. Hey, Metro has prepared a statement morning, for us. We're going to listen in. Police have arrested a woman on the FBI top 10 most wanted list. 33 year old Brenda Delgado was added to the list just earlier this week. She was captured in Mexico yesterday. North Korea tests a long range missile engine. The Korean Central News Agency reported that test. It's the largest in a series of launches carried out by the isolated nation. Battery charges have been filed against Motley Crue frontman Vince Neal after a scuffle on the Las Vegas Strip. An Indiana man wakes up in a dentist chair to find all of his teeth missing. An RTC bus driver shoots a passenger following an argument in the southwest part of the valley. Police say the incident took place outside of the bus near Dean Martin and Blue Diamond. They're unsure at this time what sparked the altercation or why the driver fired those shots. The passenger was hit in the left arm and was taken to the hospital for surgery. The scary truth about food poisoning. One in six of you will likely get sick this year from a foodborne disease. Fortunately, there are a few ways to prevent contamination in your home. Hey everybody, welcome back. Trending this morning, you may soon be able to order McDonald's breakfast <laughs> anytime you want. It's about time. The fast food giant says they plan to roll out the all-day breakfast as soon as October. McDonald's tested out the idea in some areas. The result? People loved it. The annual Santa run is happening today. Fox 5's Cassandra Jones is live downtown, ready to rock the race cast. I just saw Jason Feinberg tweeting out that he's on his way. Do you see him anywhere or is he blending in with his beard? And as you're heading out the door this morning, Shannon has a check on traffic for us. All right, that's my cue. Thank you, Cass. We're taking a live look outside the spaghetti ball this morning. Traffic not too bad, a little bit slow, so be mindful of that as you head out the door. 718 now is your time. We're going to take a look at the accidents across the valley. Looks like there's one on uh, Jones and Tropicana. Hopefully you've got lots of fun plans for Easter. Maybe you're headed off to church. Maybe the kiddos are outside on their Easter egg hunt. Either way, thanks so much for hanging out with us. It's now time for your weekend picks. We're sharing your Easter photos. This is Isaiah and Noah. Look at him. He's taking a bite out of the buddy's tie. Must be hungry. Happy Easter to both of you. And last but not least, the time a chimp became annoyed with the machine hovering above and took it down and destroyed it. Forget That's drones. I'm I'm annoyed with the selfie sticks. Oh yeah, those are the worst. And not not only not the fact right, it's, and it's not just that. It's the people that sell them. Yeah, the pay-per-view event set a UFC live gate revenue record, Shannon, of 7.2 million dollars. It's a U.S. record. Very well received fight last night. That's incredible. Great fight, but only mm -hmm. two rounds. Somewhat disappointing. Yeah, I've a little bit. Say. Yeah, a little wow. bit, but a lot more action than the Pacquiao Mayweather fight, that is I would say. That's true. A bunch of dancing around <laughs> in the ring on that one. Yeah, that's right. All yeah. right. Thank you so much, Nick. Mm -hmm.